Hello, my name is Chris, and today we're going to take a quick look at how to display data with a donut chart using Microsoft Excel. First, select both the category labels and the numbers in your data set. Then go to the Insert tab on the menu bar and click on the Pie Chart icon. A drop down menu will appear and choose the donut chart. And just like that, Excel creates a donut chart for you. But is it the most effective way to display the data? I think we can use some formatting to help guide people's attention to the key information in the donut chart. First, I want to label the different sections of the donut chart by clicking on the Add Chart Element icon and then choosing Data Labels from the drop down menu. Next, I'll choose Show. Now I have the number of units for each section. Next, I'll add the title for the donut chart by simply copying and pasting the title from the spreadsheet. The donut looks a little thin, so I will double click on the donut chart to open up the formatting panel. Then I'll change the donut hole size from 75% to 50%. That's better. The last thing I want to do is add the total number of units sold in the donut hole by clicking on the Insert tab on the top and then choosing the text box. I'll draw the text box on the donut hole and type the total number of units sold. I will also center and resize the text so it matches the other labels. Also, I want to get rid of the line and the fill of the text box so it fits seamlessly inside the donut hole. Now we've successfully created a donut chart that helps people understand motorcycle sales in Japan, which in turn will help them make a data-driven decision.